El Capitan took the two-hour bus trip to Roseville Tuesday night for some D2 first-round playoffs. I'm Mark Willis. Out of the gate, Roseville came out swinging. Riley Gustus sets it to Shelby Butters, whose shot goes down the line for the kill. Then it's a nice defensive play by Chara Deary with the block and keeps it alive. And over to Ansley Matri, who goes back to Deary for the kill. Roseville up 1-0. Second set, Wendy Vang sets it to Gianna Bellhues, who smacks it through the wickets. Then El Capitan's Vang sets up Hannah Marazade, who helps finish off the second set with this nice push shot into open area. On to the third set, Marazade gets a nice assist by Felicia Parker, who shoots a missile down the outside line, and this would be too hot to handle. In the fourth set, Tigers down 2-1, to one. Gustus sets it to... Gracie Amos, who slams it through the defense. At one point, Roseville trailed by 10. This hit here by Amos helps the Tigers get it down to two. But the Gouchers have an outside hitter who is five foot five and is a powerful hitter around the net. But it was Hannah's defense that would be the difference here as Marazade's only block of the game came on match point. She scores the final point and the team from Merced, the Gauchos from El Capitan win in four sets. I caught up with Hannah after the game. We've done pretty well in league so far. Um, I feel like a lot of our success is due to just us wanting to work together. We only have one senior this year. We want to give her everything we can. So we feel we owe it to her. And um, it feels really good to come out here and just play the way we know how to play.